Hey everybody, it's Sherry with Blessed Bobbles. Thanks so much for joining. Thanks so much. For... Hi everyone, it's Sherry with Blessed Bobbles, and I sure hope you enjoy this video. I'm very glad that you're here. Enjoy all the bobbles, and at the end, leave me a like if you like the video, okay? So have a good time. Hello everyone, it's Sherry with Blessed Bobbles, and I am back to do a quick discount video on some of the jewelry bags that are left over. They're from many different episodes. The bags do sell really well, but once in a while there's some that linger along. Maybe the price was a little too high, or maybe the person that wanted them or loved them just didn't come along yet. So. I'm coming on quick to do a little discount video. So I hope you like it, and I hope you see something that you didn't before. So I think what I'm gonna do is, we'll just take the label from the bag, because it has a lot of information on it, and I'll just put a new number one up here in the corner, okay? So thank you so much for joining me. I'm so glad that you're here. I have to tell you that because I really do mean it. I appreciate you all so, so much. I just can't believe, I still can't believe I have a YouTube channel or that anybody watched my videos and, you know, that you've liked them. So it just means a lot to me. So thank you so much. Okay, if anyone likes any of the bags, here's how you can purchase any of them. Just send me an email at capecodebaygirl at gmail.com and let me know the episode number or the video title, one, of the, one or the other, a brief description of what's in the bag, the bag number, and the price, okay? And I do answer my emails in the order that I receive them. So go ahead and send your email whenever you'd like. You don't have to wait till the end of the video. And I will open them in succession. So I appreciate you letting me share that information. And as always, if you haven't subscribed, I invite you to it's free to subscribe, it costs nothing. And if you click that bell, you'll be notified of my next video, I hope. Sometimes people's notifications are not working, and that's because you have to go on the device that you're on. Let's say you're watching from a cell phone. You have to go to your cell phone settings, and you have to go to notifications, and then allow YouTube to send you notifications. Otherwise, your phone will be blocked so you could click this all day, but it won't come through to your phone or your iPad or whatever you're using. So thanks for letting me share that. I hope it helps a lot of you. So ding, ding. So our first bag is called Off to Austria. And I'm going to just take a new number one on there. So you'll hear me with the tape a little bit. If I write over it, I just don't think it'll look as good as if I tape it. So... Bear with me, my high-tech self. So bag number one is called Off to Austria. I'll show you a little bit about the bag again, and then we'll take the price down, okay? So this bag has in it a beautiful oh, Austrian crystal black faceted beaded necklace. This is really an oldie. It just feels like a dream in the hand. Look how it moves. It's all hand knotted. The glass is, is fantastic. You'll see some of these that don't have as many facets as these. They'll have a lot less, and they're still pretty, but this is one of the true, real, um, actual, true vintage, we call it. I mean, just look at how that moves. So it's gorgeous, again, all hand knotted, and it does say Austria on the, on the little tag there, I mean, on the, on the hook, that's what I'm trying to say. So it is one of the original hook necklaces, but I put an extender on it, um, a darker metal extender in case you wanted to wear it longer. So that's what that little thing is hanging there. So this black faceted necklace is from 18 inches and it can extend to 23 and a half. There's that beautiful piece. Try to come over top, yes. Okay. And then I put with it these very, very old, probably Austrian crystal 
earrings again. I mean, look how old they are. I just thought they really belonged together with that necklace. Definitely faceted glass. Look on the side right here. See how the light hits it? You know that's faceted glass right there. So very, very cool screw back earrings. And then I have this black faceted glass beaded bracelet. It's on the stretch, but it's on a really good stretch. And it has some clear crystal beads along with it. So very pretty. And that sits at a seven and a quarter, but again, it's on a stretch. Then I put with it some pierced earrings. I always try to give you guys some, some uh, clip-ons and some pierced. And again, we have some black faceted glass, silver tone, because I thought it looked good with the uh, crystal beads right here. And that is that set. And all the measurements I've given you, and I had it at 52. These vintage pieces really do sell that high, but it's okay. I don't mind taking the price down at all. Um, I will take this down to, we'll do 42 on this one. So there's your nut bag number one, off to Austria for $42, okay? So in goes these super old screw back earrings, very gently your pierced earrings, this all glass bracelet, it's super awesome. I have one of these and I just, oh my gosh, I just love to like hold it. It just moves so beautifully. Mine is not on the hook like this. I wish it was, but it's not, but I love it very much. It's very wearable and I stack it with a lot of things. And you probably see me wearing it on some of the videos. So that's that bag. Next one is called Soft Sparkle. Hi, Bolty. Oh, no, you already had your supper. You're trying to get in the picture, aren't you? Well, I'd get you up here, but you're too big. So this will be bag number two called Soft Sparkle. In this bag, we have some lovely pinks and some silvery really sparkly colors. It's a nice long necklace, gold tone clasp, really pretty gold beads into these milky faceted glass again. And then it comes into these uh, pink tone and some more silvery faceted glass. Really pretty the way they have the pink threading in the middle. And then it comes down to this nice large piece here and the tassel I have it wrapped up nicely so it'll stay nice but it's like a pinkish silver tone tassel and like I said last time if you don't like tassels you can even take that off but this is what the necklace looks like it goes into those different colors really nice glass again can never do that that way okay there we go, with the pink and the silver. So I want you to see how these beads are a little bit different than these on the bottom. So there's different grades of color and it's beautiful. And then that gold tone is just lovely. So 32 inches on this necklace. Then I have three bracelets, nice chunky glass pink. And this one is more sparkly with the same variations as that. It's got a little, like a, a roundel on it. And then another bracelet with some more silvery color colors in it. And that matches really pretty. Then I have these pierced earrings. Nice, milky, faceted. These are acrylic. But they look really glass, don't they? So I like those earrings with it very much. And the way they throw off the gold tone is pretty cool. And then I'm adding a pair of rhinestone earrings with gold tone posts. In case you didn't want to wear the danglies, you can wear the more simple. So there's that set. And I had that at $40. And I'm going to take that down to $30. Okay? 
So bag number two is called Soft Sparkle for $30. I'm going to put it all back in the bag. And you know what? After the video, I'm going to have to take everything out of the bags again because I make my thumbnail. But that's okay. It's all worth it. Very much worth it. Remember what will be number three is called Avon Pretty in Pink. So on goes our new number three. Again, I would just write over it, but it would look terrible. <laughs> Bag number three, Avon Pretty in Pink. And let's see, it's been a while since I showed this one. So yes, this is an Avon necklace. It's a pink crystal with pave stones around the sides. What a nice piece of crystal that is. Silver tone, it's marked on the back and it's on a silver tone snake chain, lobster clasp. And I already measured this one. It is 18 to 20 inches fully extended. So there's your necklace gotta get us just right here oh you know what i think my phone is like the phone holder is kind of slipping slowly so you guys are probably going and i don't even know it but i'll try to fix it so there's your avon necklace and i have a pair of avon pink crystal earrings as well they have another crystal at the top silver tone so those go with it and we have three silver tone bangles with a little bit of texture and these measure eight inches and i think that's all i had with that bag because that was a very particular color pink i do remember that so we had that one at 25 and i will take that one down to 20 dollars even okay bag three avon pretty in pink for twenty dollars okay I hope it's not confusing and that it's going well I have done this before but I usually do it during a video that I have new bags but this one is all discount baby the whole video and you know why because I have a new box of jewelry it's a whopper and it's gonna be great and I can't wait to start that series so I am cleaning house, cleaning out, and getting ready for that new series. And I hope you are going to look forward to that and click that bell and all that good stuff. So this is going to be bag number four. A little tape dewy on there. Oh, and this one's called Pretty Pearls. Bag number four, Pretty Pearls. And this looks like a lovely vintage glass pearl necklace. It has a silver tone fish clasp. They are hand knotted. Lovely glass pearls with a really soft yellowish, a little bit golden tone to them. Really pretty color. And that is 18 inches. And then I say plus three with an extender. I must give an extend. Yep, here it is. So three inch gold extender comes with that so 18 to 18 90 21 inches <laughs> had to count on my fingers gee and here's your stretch bracelet I do match the color of pearls so I hope that's a good match really good stretch on that it sits at seven inches but it stretches and then to go with this set I added these cute little grape cluster earrings they are pierced with a little gold ball at the top. And look at the gradation of them. Isn't that adorable? I've seen a lot of these earrings, but I haven't seen any that get so tiny on the bottom. Super cute, gold tone, and they're set on those little pins. And again, I like the color of the pearls. They go really well. And then I have this cute little brooch. It is gold tone with some little danglies obviously it's very art nouveau looking and I, I know that 
now even more because of Jason's videos. So thank you, Jason Adams, for your recent Art Nouveau video. It was great. And here's the back. And that does look really pretty on the necklace, or you can just wear it as a brooch. Lovely gold tone on that. So this bag was $30, and I'm going to take this one down to $25. So bag number four, Pretty Pearls, $25. And you get those cool vintage earrings, the lovely brooch, this bracelet, glass pearls, all hand knotted, nice set and an extender. So that's bag four. And along comes bag five. Oh, I remember this bag. Well, I remember all of them, but I really remember this because this is so, so lovely and unique and vintage. So I'm putting my tape on. We have bag number five called Rosy Japan. And we had it at 52. So first comes our rosy Japan. Oh my gosh. Now I remember I said I was going to keep this. Oh boy. Okay. Um, it's a beautiful pink pearl, faux pearl necklace. It has this box clasp, silver tone. And it's a really, really long piece. And this must be marked Japan because I wouldn't say Japan for nothing. So it says Japan on the clasp. Okay. It's really, really long, very soft and, and very, um, what can I say? Very soft color pink, just a beautiful, beautiful color. And it is 56 inches long, five, six. And I explained last time, you see this little space in between, that's okay. You're gonna need that because when you go to wear it maybe in three, you always need that little extra room on the, on the string so the beads can move around. So there you go, it's so pretty. Lots of pink pearls, you can always wear your clasp in the front if you'd like, lots of people do. And with that, I have a lovely pink stretch bracelet. And again, it's on a great stretch. It's a little bit different tone, but not too bad. Then I have these really great earrings. So cute with the bow and the rhinestone and that pink drop pearl. Really super pair of earrings. There's the back to them, they're wonderful. And they look awesome with that set. Then I brought in this scarf clip and showed you how beautiful it looks on the pearls if you want to wear it as a pendant or just as a scarf clip on its own. So lovely, very long set of signed Japan pink pearls. Just a great, great set. And these are pretty uh, solid and vintage as well. These are really good quality. So the earrings are nice. So in go your earrings and your bracelet, your scarf clip in gold tone to go with the earrings and your really long Japan pink necklace. See how I can fold it up that many times? That's a good piece. You don't want something that's really stiff and that can't move and do all the things you want it to. So. They really did a good job with this. So that's bag five, Rosie Japan. And I'm gonna take this price down to 45, okay? Bag five, Rosie Japan, $45. Okay, what have we got next? Oh, another one from way back. This I think is from the holidays. So this will be fun. And this is going to be bag number six. My little papers. I recycle everything. Um, when I print out your shipping labels and I have to cut them out, this is all the trimmings around the labels and then I use them for earrings and I use them for everything. So 
appreciate you putting up with my paper stuff. Okay, bag six is called Rhinestone Chevron, and it was at 36. It is a beautiful, classic rhinestone chevron necklace. It's got that older spring ring clasp. Chain is in beautiful condition. There's the back. And here's your rhinestone front. And that little V-shape is what they call chevron. Beautiful piece, really well done. So shiny, sparkly. And that is 18 inches. And then I have a vintage rhinestone bracelet, a tennis style, and this is seven inches. Really, really cute piece. Maybe rhodium plated, I'm not sure. But I love the smaller rhinestones because the necklace has smaller. You don't wanna to get too off scale. And again, with the earrings, nice and tiny, pierced earrings, they're all prong set rhinestones and nice new backs on them. And I like the shape of those with that necklace. And then I love these little clip-ons. They have that chevron shape again. They're just little tiny, adorable little clip-ons from way back in the day. And those go with it. I always try to give you clip-ons and pierced earrings. So that's it for bag number six. You've got vintage rhinestone earrings, nice tiny scale, vintage clip-on earrings, again, small scale, your bracelet, and your rhinestone chevron necklace. And look how this one moves too. I mean, I can fold that up, which is nice. And this one was at 36. And I'll take this one down to 23. So number six, Rhinestone Chevron for 23. Okay, we are moving along. Now we are going to get some bags from another video. And let's see. Oh, this one is so pretty. So pretty. These I think only showed once. So, another piece of tape. And we'll put our new number on it. This will be bag number seven. And it's called Vintage Love. And it was 37. Yeah. Bag number seven, Vintage Love for 37. And we have this absolutely stunning necklace. The gold tone, spring ring um, findings and things are perfect condition. It is acrylic. It's that heavier vintage acrylic. Gold tone beads in between, and then the frosted gold tone. Shiny, frosted again. So that's the piece. It's a nice long necklace at 24 inches. And I'll set it here. And get the fuzzy off. Let me just clasp this so it'll stay up there for us while we look at the other pieces. Otherwise, I think it's going to keep slipping off. I always have that little spot on my nail for opening, um, opening these little clasps all day. Come on, babe. Looks like it says something on there. Oh, I remember this one now. This is that vintage Korea that we were all like, wow. We haven't seen many vintage necklaces Korea that weren't just a gold chain. This is a beauty. Really gorgeous. Can you imagine that with a really pretty outfit on? I'm trying to think what colors. Gosh, well, you can wear white and gold with anything, but a nice long necklace at 24 inches. And I have these awesome, cute little clip-on gold bead ball earrings. These feel really nice. Very nice quality on those. And doesn't that look great with that shiny bead ball on the side? And also the gold tone matches too. Then I have this gold tone bracelet. It's in great condition, lobster clasp. This measures from 7 to 8 inches. You can wear it 
either seven or all the way extended to eight. So there's your gold bracelet, or as I say, a little shimmer on your wrist. And of course, we have to have some cute, beautiful little white hearts. They are like a double dangly articulated earring. Just turn it this way, there we go. And they're on gold tone metal, great shape. And I love those with that white enamel. It looks so good. So you've got some pierced earrings. You've got your vintage gold tone clip-ons. They look like screwbacks, but they're clip-ons. And your gold tone bracelet. And this awesome vintage Korea shiny and frosted gold tone necklace. And now I've got to undo it all, but that's okay. And I'm going to wrap this up, put it in a bag. And yeah, I remember this one now. Really pretty. So this is bag seven, and it was at $37. And I am going to price it now at, we'll do 30 even. Bag seven, vintage love for $30. Okay. Ooh, this is a nice one too. This one is the Mother of Pearls. Remember this set? This is going to be bag number eight. Sticky my new tag on there. The Mother of Pearls. Okay. This is a gorgeous necklace, gold tone, fish hook clasp. It is all Mother of Pearl shell. And it comes down into these gold bead balls. And then I think we figured out that this was black coral. I remember looking at it closely last time. And that these beads had some kind of, they were either wood and painted over or something else. Can you see that little glitter in there? Anyway, they come back down again into the black color the mother of pearl again and they finish off with the same pattern gorgeous mother of pearl it's so pretty and that's a 22 inch necklace and then i have this black onyx this is a gold filled bracelet it is 120th 14 karat gold filled all of the beads and the finings are gold filled it has real pearls and it has black onyx hearts on it as well. It's all been tested. So you've got real pearls on the bracelet and that measures seven inches. Now you could extend this, put a couple of rings in there and extend it too, if you need to. But And then I have these, I think these are the Trafari earrings. So let me hold them the right way. They clip like this, yes. Trafari rose earrings. How pretty is that? And the color is really great. So I love those with that. And then I have some vintage black faceted and gold tone pierced earrings. And I love those with it too. And then I have that little bag for the Trafari earrings. So the Mother of Pearls, bag number eight. You have pierced earrings. And they always, by the way, they always have new backs or something very clean, but usually brand new. If I can save the vintage older backs, if I can get them clean enough, I will save them. But for now, they're all brand new backs. Then there goes your Trafari earrings and your 14 karat gold filled real pearl and onyx bracelet and this lovely mother of pearl with the vintage clasp necklace. So in goes all of that. This was at $43. And I'm going to take this one down to, we'll do 35 okay? I think the bracelet's probably worth that, as well as the Trafari earrings. So hopefully someone will fall in love with that. And if not, I'll make use of everything again. I'm not worried, but I do love it when you 
right to me and you just love something. It's really a thrill. That's why I do what I do. Okay, bag number nine. Get my new number on there. This one is called Lux Blue, and it was for 32. And this is one of those Lux necklaces. There's the tag. There you go, Lux Jewelry, I think it says. Beautiful gold tone chain, and I give you an extender too, so that's what this extra thing is hanging there. So gold tone. Gorgeous teal faceted beads, some milky color in between, and some more gold tone, and the pattern continues. So just a gorgeous Lux Jewels necklace in that teal color. It measures 16 inches, but with the extender you can go to 21. So that's that piece, and this perfect color match bracelet. Again, with gold bead balls and the clear crystal, but these match so well. I mean, look at that color. It's great. So that was fun. And then I have these faceted glass earrings pierced, and they are gold wires as well. And again, always nice, clean new backs on them. So that's your Lux Blue set. It was, yes, it's bag number nine. And we've got earrings and the bracelet and the Lux Jewels and your brand new extender. In your little baggie it goes. And that was at 32. And I will take this price down to, let's do 25, okay? So if you like that, bag number nine, Lux Blue, or Luxury Blue, I guess I called it, for 25. We are moving on to bag number 10. It's so funny because it used to be nine. I don't want to confuse you by showing you, but <laughs> it's funny if I kind of thought about it. I could have left the number on there, but it's okay. So now I just confused myself. Oh my gosh. So this is bag 10, bag number 10 sticky on there and this one was called golden tassels and I had it at $30. This is another one of those incredibly milky and gold faceted glass beaded necklaces. This has a silver tone extender and clasp and just gorgeous sparkly faceted beads with that gold and the white and they're all separated by gold bead balls. And it comes down to a lovely leather tassel, and I have it all wrapped up nicely. And there's your decorative bale that's on it. So I'll give this a little wrap so we can see how it looks on the neck with the leather tassel. And I, I always say, if you're not a tassel person, you can take that off and you'll just have that cute little bead ball right there. I mean, that cute little faceted glass right there. So there's that piece. And then I have this triple bracelet set with sort of a peachy color faceted bead, some clear, some of those milky ones. And all three of them are attached together with a little chain and a cute little tassel. So there's your tassel theme again. These earrings, oh my gosh, I don't know who made them, but they're stunning. They are all rhinestones in gold tone. They're really brilliant. That's the back. Love those, such beautiful sparkle. And then a pair of nice big rhinestone prong set earrings in a gold tone post. So that's that set bag number 10 and we've got your triple bracelet set pierced earrings another pair of pierced and this really cool milky very sparkly necklace with the tassel 
So there you go with that one. And this one was $30. And I'm going to take this one down. Let's just do $20 on that one, okay? So golden tassels, bag number 10, is now $20. Okay, we're getting down to it. Getting right down to it. And I am getting excited about opening a new box. It's always fun. Always, always fun. And I'm telling you, I shopped and shopped at Shop Goodwill. I looked at the pictures for days. I bid on boxes and lost. I have never lost before, but I lost several auctions. They're getting really tough to win. And I won a box that I really wanted. But every time I don't win, I just say, you know, it's not your will, God, and I just move on. I'm not too worried about it, so I'm sure whatever box that I got is going to be just the one I'm supposed to have and just the one that you're all supposed to have, too, because you get the jewelry. Okay, bag 11 is called Chorus of Coral, and I had it at $46. And this is the Red Coral Necklace. This nice long piece of red coral, silver tone chain, lobster clasp, and it's just got loads and loads of coral chips. Really beautiful color. On and on, nice long piece, so you could wear it very long. I have a coral necklace with barrel beads, and it's long, and I do wear it long. I like it like that. So that's what it looks like doubled. What a dream, right? This is 36 to 38 inches. When you wear it fully extended, it's 38 inches. So that's your coral. And then I have this bracelet. I can't remember if this is exactly what came with it, like it's supposed to match. I think so, because the beads are exactly, they're exactly the same size and color and everything. So it is a match. Well, that's nice. That's great. So that bracelet measures seven to eight inches because you can hook it anywhere along this chain. So seven to eight matching bracelet. And then I didn't have coral earrings, but I did have these cute red earrings that are on these lever backs. And the color matches very nicely. So I was very happy with that. So you have Real red coral, triple bracelet, nice pair of red earrings, and a very long red coral necklace that you can even clip something on, like a scarf clip or something, as a little pendant. And I had this one at 46 and I'll take this price down to, we'll do 35 So bag 11, chorus of coral, is now $35. I hope that's okay. It's kind of messy, but I hope it's okay. All right, that is bag 11. Okay, bag 12. I was so sure that this bag was going to sell, like, in two seconds. It's so pretty. It's so different. I think just the right person just didn't see it yet because it's too fabulous. Just too, too fabulous. So this is bag 12. And sometimes there were things going on when I'd post my video, like something happened on the news, things that you can't predict. So if you don't have the watchers that night, sometimes it doesn't always go great. But this is bag number 12 called Spring Paradise. And this is the gorgeous set. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. With these long, this long necklace with these beautiful white beads. I think I added an extender. Yes, I did. So silver tone extender. Lobster clasp. Really beautiful, dense white beads. Green, blue, and then to this beautiful pendant. This is metal. It's all enamel, silver tone, and then you've got these cabochon rhinestone pieces in the middle. Just really pretty 
so different, so awesome, so runway. This, if I put this on eBay, I'd call this runway. It's a beauty. And then the bracelet I have is a gorgeous acrylic, the perfect blue. It's got great stretch on it. And it's so cute with that, just adorable. And then, this is the best part of it all. I have these orange earrings, they're clip-ons. They're so springtime, they're so, again, so runway enamel with the orange and yellow. Absolutely fabulous, my goodness. And the matching brooch, I mean, come on. Look how big it is too, it's really cool. Gold tone on the back and just incredible really incredible and if that's too much of course you don't have to wear the brooch with it or you could wear the brooch with and the earrings with something else it's just a fabulous really cool set so i'm gonna put this back in this bag and keep it separate from the other because i don't even want earrings to scratch anything so i'll put the earrings to the back of the brooch see like that so they don't scratch each other I just, I just have to do things that way because you don't want anything to get ruined. And in goes your bracelet. By the way, the necklace is 17 inches to 20 inches with the extender. Okay, so 17 to 20. The bracelet sits at 7 inches, but it is a stretch. And you saw the earrings. So that is that piece. Beautiful enamel, really thick piece. It is certainly a beautiful statement. And you know that it came together because of the matching of those colors. Totally awesome. Great statement bag. So bag 12, Spring Paradise. I had it at 62. I did pay up for those pieces, but it's okay. I didn't pay more than that, so. And I'm gonna take this down to I'm going to still say, I'm going to say 52, so that's $10 off. And I'm going to have to write an, <laughs> I have to write a new one because it looks so messy. And I don't want you to look at the screen and get all confused about it, so. It was at 62, and I am now taking it to 52, Okay. So bag 12, Spring Paradise for 52. Hey, we got all our information, right? That's what matters. So there goes that one. And now it's gonna give me trouble because it's sticky. Okay. Now, bag 13. Oh yes, this one's nice, super nice. Bag 13 is called Precious Pearls. And there's our new number, Precious Pearls, and I had it at 59. And that is because the necklace is made of real pearls, absolutely gorgeous Baroque pearls. They're a pink color with maybe like a champagne color. They're on the toggle. And they are just nice, big Baroque pearls with crystals in between. Can you see that shape? Isn't that just cool? Look at the luster. Just beautiful, beautiful. Each one is so unique that it's really fun to just look at them sometime. And just imagine what it took to make that, right? And there's your beautiful toggle clasp with the heart shape on it. Really wish I knew that maker. And to go with that, I have a matching bracelet with the exact same pearls. It's on a stretch, it's in great condition with the same crystals. So maybe an artisan person made this, I think, but the pearls are fabulous. And then I have the exact matching earrings too. So they must have taken the same kind of pearls and made the pair of earrings too. So. It really all matches and is beautiful. So this is bag 13 with your real Baroque pearls and a pinkish champagne color. 
it is 19 inches on the necklace, um, a stretch bracelet, and a toggle clasp. Gorgeous crystals. Nice, heavy, ice cold pearls. I hope you love that one. And that was bag 13. I had it at 59. And I am going to take this one down to 49 because that's a lot of nice real pearls. So bag 13 precious pearls for 49. Okay. Oh, I thought this video would go faster since I'm not showing everything for the first time. But we do have 14 bags, and that's a lot. So, oh, this one's so adorable. I love this bag. Put my new number on it. Bag 14 is called Rhinestone Love, and I had a price of 42 on it. Now, this necklace is on a really nice quality chain. This chain feels great. Nice big links to it. It's super long. Feels great, moves great. It's got a nice finish on it. And this nice big fat heart. It feels like a nice heavy black acrylic pave stones or rhinestones all around the edge, I should say. And that's the back. So super long. How great is it to have a big giant heart like that on a long, long chain. I think that's so pretty. And long necklaces feel nice to wear. Do you ever notice how just nice they feel when you're wearing a long piece? So that's it on the neck. Really big heart. That's, I would say, probably two and a half inches wide at least. And it's a nice heavy piece. And then I have these silver tone heart earrings with some clear crystals on top of them and little silver bead balls on the top of that. There's the back. I like how these are open to let the, the sparkle through on those little crystals in there in your heart theme. And then I have this really pretty little bracelet. Nice quality again on the rhinestones. It's a tennis style bracelet silver tone finished with these cute little rhinestones here and it's on that slide just really sparkly and this is from seven to eight inches whichever you want you just adjust it and then i'm adding these rhinestone stud earrings with um, on a gold tone post so there's your rhinestone love set this rhinestone bracelet, these stud earrings, your heart theme earrings, and this nice long chain, this super awesome heart piece on it. So that's your rhinestone love. And I had this set at 42. And I'll give that a good scribble so we don't get confused. And I'll take this one down to an even 30. So bag 14, rhinestone love is 30, okay? So thank you so much for letting me show you all the discounted bags and show them to you again. Some of them are just shown for the second time. And I forgot to stop in the video and tell you how to purchase the jewelry. I do that often because I get so into what I'm doing. So here's my email. It is, let me show you this one instead, capecodebaygirl at gmail.com. And just let me know the name of this episode or episode number, a brief description of what's in the bag, the bag number, and the price, okay? And I do answer the emails in the order they are received, so send them off whenever you'd like, and I'll get to them. If I don't get to them right away, it doesn't mean that I haven't that you didn't win the item or that you didn't you didn't get it. It just means I haven't got to the emails yet. So don't worry about that. And lastly, I would like to invite you to subscribe to my channel. I would really love to have you as a subscriber if you are not already. And if you are, thank you so much. 
I had a great time repricing these. I hope you love something and you'll click that bell and that you'll come back again and we'll see you next time at the Bobbles. Bye. Hey, thanks so much for watching the video. I'm so glad that you were here. I hope you had a great time and we'll see you next time at the Bobbles.